Hello, fellow engineers, and welcome back to Thronefall, where we are a king on a horse with tiny little legs. Look how small they are. And this time, we're heading back to this map to take on some of the other challenges on here. So in this one, we're going to be using one of these mutators. We're going to be challenging the snake god. Wait, does that say snake or snafe? The snafe god. You may remember last time we beat the kraken. I think that unlocked us this heavy sword. So we're definitely going to be giving that a go. Then we just got to pick some perks. I don't want to admit this, but I feel like the Architects Council is one of the better ones. Ew. But since the Snafe God gives us minus 50% gold, let's go with this, the Royal Mint, to give us extra gold. Oh, and actually, that is depending on the level. I get extra gold if I were to use the Architects Council. Okay, editor, just censor my mouse here, okay? We're definitely not selecting that one. Right, so anyway, here we are in here. So we come over to our castle for three coins. You can see in the bottom right, we have nine coins available to us. That gives us a brand new castle. And because we've got the Architect Council, it's technically a level two castle, which means that we've unlocked almost everything here. Uh, now, I know I'm going to get less money than ever, 50% less. So what I probably want to do is focus on getting money as soon as possible, because the earlier I'm earning it, the more we'll have in total. Oh, I've just found a button. You can see everything you can build at the current castle stage. Okay, I've got six coins. How do I want to spend them? Do I need defenses or am I going to be okay on my own? Let's, let's go have a look and see what's attacking us. Oh, just three blokes with swords and shields. Okay, let's let's go all out money then. So houses for two gold generates us one coin. A windmill for three coins only generates us one. But then I think we can build extra fields, which gets us extra coins for just one. So that would be five coins invested to get three coins back per turn. I am the smart. Oh, so using a bit of maths, I think we found out the mill is better. So let's do that. Oh, we get an upgrade for these as well. Every future upgrade of this mill will increase its income even more. Scarecrows have a strong anti-air attack. Ooh, maybe I should do that because that's like free defense. Yeah, that is free defense. I'm doing I'm doing the scarecrows. So you can see there's a scarecrow in both of these fields. Uh, oh, and I've sort of made the strongest shape. You may have to like squint your eyes a little bit, but I definitely see that. Anyway, let's come down here. We'll stand on the bridge and we will defend it. And then, oh no, I've forgotten how to attack. I've forgotten how to attack. What button is it? What button is it? So, oh, it's really slow to reload. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, this was a mistake. This was a mistake. They destroyed one of my fields. Come on, hit them. Oh, no. Right, they're after me. They're after me. I think I've saved my last field. It's got a very small amount of health. Right, recharge, recharge. There we go. Oh, this this sword actually sucks. <laughs> it's not very strong at all. All right, there we go. Oh, man. I've only got... I'm up to six coins. That's not too bad. But look, my right nut, my field there does not get us anything. That's not good. Yeah, and we're being attacked from up there tonight by eight. Eight troops. I feel like I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to invest in like... A bit of protection. Yeah, I think melee units are going to be required. Okay, so four coins into there. What do we want? Knights, spearmen, or the flails? Let's go with the spearmen this time. So we can select with these guys, and then I can run up here and say, right, defend there. Yeah, we've got two more coins to spend. I may, if I come back to this corner, just invest them into a house because that'll get me an extra coin tonight. Anyway, as I have a bit of help on my team, we should be all right. Thankfully, I am distracting them quite a lot. It takes so long to recharge my sword though. Thankfully, the spearmen doing the business. All right, so we got a load of coins. We're, we're up to seven, which is good. But we are going to be attacked from two different angles. So up here, we're being attacked by turtles. If I take these guys down here, we've got eight of those attacking. So I think what I may need to do is leave you lot there. I think you can probably handle that without me. And then if I pump seven coins into that, they are archers. You can go with longbow archers with a longer range, but a fragile or the crossbowmen. I think let's go with the longbow ones. And we'll grab these guys. I think we'll shove them there. And then I'm going to start up here. But first, I've got three coins to spend. I think we'll build this windmill down here. Do I want scarecrows? Probably. Let's do it. And then i got no coins remaining. So, yeah, I'm going to go up to the very top of the map. And then hopefully while I'm fighting these turtles, yeah, these guys will, will archer them from far away. So, ready? Boosh. Oh, man. Oh, man. Look at my health. That was brutal. <laughs> 
All right, okay, nice. Let's grab the archers because that was two of them. We know there's only going to be two. We'll bring him down this way. And I'm going to sword all of those. Man, my sword's actually quite good. Like, the area damage is fantastic. All right. Oh, we're up to eight coins. I tell you what, I feel like the coins are not too bad. Although, little concerned, it looks like, yeah, eight archers are going to attack us from every single direction. Yeah, and we've only got eight troops ourselves. The spearmen, anyway, they're quite bad at ranged attacks. So I'll tell you what, I'll grab two of them, bring them up this way. So you defend that. You two up here. Then I might just do two archers. Then hopefully they can defend that. And then I'll try and defend at the bottom. Is there anything I can do up here? I mean, there is a turret I can do. Yeah, I guess we'll do that. So turret. Then I got five coins to invest. So I think we definitely got to get these fields in. Then an extra three coins. I know it's probably going to get destroyed, but let's get this mill in. Oh, I could make this one an explosive trap. Or do I just keep going with the scarecrows? I mean, we're not being attacked by anything in the air yet, but I can't change these upgrades later. Yeah, I think we'll, we'll, we'll make an explosive trap, that one. All right, and then troops. I'm not going to be around to defend you this time. I've got to do my own arm. I must defend the bridge because I was an engineer. So good luck all. We're going to start the night. All right, thankfully, these archers, they're like, I'm not letting King Matt like defend everything on his own. They uh, came to save me. Unfortunately, it meant the spearmen got absolutely mullered. All right, boosh. Okay, okay, there's only two more. All right, just one remaining. I think that's fine. Yeah, oh, we've done it. We've only gone and done it. Um, we're not being attacked from up here. So let's grab you lot. Grab all of you as well. So down here, we're being attacked by 15 two-legged turtles. Now, the common misconception with two-legged turtles is they've only got two legs. So they can't really do a lot. Especially if they're on land. I mean, turtles are underwater creatures. But don't let them fool you. The two-legged turtles are very, very dangerous. I think that should be good. Anyway, I got 12 coins to spend. So let's get some of the money stuff going. I'm tempted to put a wall in. I'm not going to lie. Four coins though. I mean, it could save my castle. Yeah, let's get the wall in. Let's get the wall in. And then I got six coins remaining. I think I'll just invest in houses. Because the more houses we get earlier on, the more money we get later on. And I like me some money. All right, so I'm going to lead the line with this guy. It's like me and Paddy at the... Well, actually, no. Me and Paddy would be me and the horse. Who are you? You're one of my editors. It can't be Scarecrow because Scarecrow's in the field over there. I would say Schmeichel, but Schmeichel's a massive letdown. Maybe Suited Bird. Don't know. Anyway, it's not important. We're being distracted. Let's just get to the night so we can defend ourselves. All right, turtles. Oh, no, look. They're going straight for the castle. There's two. There's two. They're taking down my walls. <laughs> All right, actually, my area effect. Boosh. Oh, that actually worked quite well. They're trying to get in the doors, but they're not allowed. We defended. And look at all the money coming in from the farms. We are up to 15 coins. That is nice. In fact, I think I'm going to invest in the new castle. Seven coins. Uh, we get an upgrade from this. So do I give myself 75% attack and hook? Do I do the Builder's Guild? Because that will level up some of my houses automatically. Could be very useful as I'm lacking money. Or well, Magic Armor. Enemies that deal damage to you take that part of damage themselves. That's quite interesting. I think I'm going to go with the Builder's Guild though. I think as I'm not getting much money, I think if I can get free investments, that is all good. Yeah, then I got eight coins remaining. What are we being attacked by tonight? Let's just grab all these people. 20 knights and 20 archers. Yeah, our, our army is not big enough to take that on. So, eight coins. Do I go with the barracks or the archers? I think the barracks. So, we got four more spearmen. We'll shove these up here. I need to move. I want to move the archers back a bit. So, archers, you're back there. Spearmen, you got to hold the line at the front. Now, I've got no coins. So, let's start the night. Come on, troops. We will defend. Oh, they're doing a fantastic job. Do I even have to do anything here? Oh, I probably should. We're being outnumbered. We're being outnumbered. Why didn't I attack? All of our spearmen are down. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Oh, we're in trouble. We are in trouble this time. We've lost that windmill there. Oh, this is really not good. Oh, I just got killed as well. I wasn't paying attention. Come on, revive. Revive. Right, as soon as I get up. Yep, yeah, we're just... Boosh with the sword. Now run away from the arrows. Oh, man. They are, they are very strong. At least I'm distracting them. 
because I don't want to lose all my windmills because then I get no money next round. Right, a little sword attack. I've got to wait so long in between. We did survive though, but only just. We didn't get that many coins because we didn't get money from this windmill. We didn't get any from that windmill. Not ideal. Um, where are we being attacked from tonight? Oh, down here. 15 two-legged turtles. And I think these are a different one because it's back legs rather than front legs. I'm pretty sure these are the flying ones. So tonight, I think the best investment, eight coins straight into the archers. Well, actually, I can get I can get more archers. Four coins. I've got five. Yeah, I'll tell you what. Let's just survive the night first. So I think we're going longbow. I feel like longbow archers, they're pretty good, actually. So we'll shove these right on the edge of the water. And then we'll start the battle. Yeah, look, they're flying. Oh, you can see my scarecrows doing stuff. Come on, scarecrows. Get involved. I feel like my editor scarecrow needs to see this. Actually, I'm going to make him edit this. Scarecrow, I want you to be more proactive like these. <laughs> really? If you could, like, just stand in a field like that, I'd be so proud of you. Right, anyway, that was a good battle. So we got all of our archers here. We're being attacked by 30 knights there. And up here, a load of different turtles. I think the, the ones on the left, they're, like, the strong ones. The ones that just try to rush everything. So tell you what, might just leave all of my archers here. Or maybe, like, split them a little bit. All right, then a few spearmen at the top to get the attacks. And then you lot... Go guard the bridge. Right, and this time I've got 19 coins to play with. That is not bad. I think let's upgrade this windmill and then get some more fields. Because this is going to get us a lot of money per turn. Uh, for now though, I reckon let's just get more of those troops. I might go with the knights because I feel like archers did sort of ruin me a little bit earlier. Then is it too cocky just to put the rest of my money into like more stuff? I don't know what end I'm going to need to be. So I'm just going to start in the middle and we'll try and work out who needs my help the most. I feel like it's probably going to be up here. I was like, oh no, what? They killed me. They killed me. I was meant to be helping them, but I haven't helped at all. Oh, the spearman up the top is getting destroyed. Boosh, eat sword. Run away, run away, run away. Oh, down here we're being destroyed as well. All right, boosh, sword. Oh, I'll tell you what. I think we have held them at bay. We haven't lost. We haven't lost any windmills. All right, nice. Now we get some cash. And now we're being attacked by every angle. And are they all two-legged turtles? Yeah, they're all the flying variety. Oh, apart from down here, we got big dudes with bouquets. So basically, I need archers sort of everywhere. But you lot, the ground troops, you've all got to come down here. Uh, I think what I might do, I might upgrade... Where's my other archers there? Yeah, eight coins. I can get four more archers. That sounds good. All right, I think we're pretty well set up. So, 21 coins... Let's focus on cash investment because I want more cash back. Oh, and these guys, they're scarecrows, aren't they? So they would help defend the skies as well. All right, then I got 14 coins. Let's get some houses back here. I think I may as well just do like every house to level one and hope they just auto upgrade. Okay, so I'm only going to be able to help defend the bridge because I can't attack stuff in the air. Um, oh, wow. These things are huge, though. Oh, look at the scarecrows, by the way. The scarecrows are insane. Man, that is a big bouquet. Thankfully, it didn't matter. We defended. And look at all these coins coming towards me. So that is fantastic. What isn't fantastic, we're going to be attacked from three different sides. And there's a bouquet man at every single angle. Oh, dear. Definitely going to need to upgrade my barracks to get four more knights. You can come up here. I've got 34 coins, though. Wait, wait. I can upgrade my castle. 20 coins. Yeah, let's do that. Let's upgrade our castle. Oh, so much coinage going in there. Yeah, so this one, I just get a load of attack and hoop. And then, oh, I can upgrade the mill again. So rather than give me two coins, that'll give me six coins. Okay, that's definitely worth upgrading. I'm going to do the one down here as well, because I think that one's safe. That should get us 12 extra coins next go. I'll then build a cheeky house there, and then we should be good. So let's start the night. All right, they're looking good. Up here, they've just been slaughtered. So I'm going to help those. At least till they respawn. Come on, regen. Regen. Oh, no. Down the bottom. Down the bottom. Defend the bridge. Oh, there's the bokeh man as well. Right, I'm distracting them over this way. Oh, no. Up here, we're being destroyed. All right, it's okay. It's okay. The archers from the north, they came to the rescue. Good old northerners. I knew I could trust them, really. And then look at all these coins. Yes. Okay, now we have 50 coins. It looks like we're only being attacked from the bottom. But remember, the two-legged turtles with the spikes down the back, they're the ones that go straight for the castle. So I don't want to shove everything at the back. So you knights, I reckon you lot stand like back here. 
these archers. I'm going to shove you like, shove you back there in the castle walls. I think that will be really, really helpful. And everyone else, you sort of just defend the bridge. I reckon that's quite a good, quite a good plan of attack. I'll tell you what, I will invest in that windmill. And then I'm going to do all these turrets. All right, then I got 32 coins. Should I just do like two sets of like barracks? So barrack there. I'll do the archery range there. Shove the archers there. Shove the spearmen there. Right, then we've got a lot of troops along this path. Let's let's start the night. I'm at the front because I am the king. I will defend everyone. Oh no, look. This is what I thought would happen. The turtles are going straight through. I think I need to run in there. And boosh, die. And then run away before the arrows can hit me. Oh, look at the meat shield at the front. Cheers, everyone. We're good. Boosh. That was perfect. That was so good. And now we get loads of coins because all of our windmills are upgraded. 58 big ones to spend. Are we being attacked? Oh, is it just that? Just five turtles. Well, that seems a bit easy. I'll tell you what. Let's upgrade this. We can upgrade it again for 15 coins. And then we can give it a special power. So this turret could either be a fortress tower comes an armored fortress that can shoot two enemies at once. Sounds good. Ballista, very powerful, but low rate of fire. That's good against like large enemies, but that's about it. Hot oil, pause hot oil. I did that before. I'm not sure it was that good. I don't think I've ever done the fortress one. So let's have a go with that. I think we may as well wall up our city. I think that seems sensible. And then I should probably... Probably give myself more troops. So 16 in there. I won't have enough to do the other one. What I can do with it is just upgrade some of these towers. And three coins remaining. There's a turret down here I haven't built yet. So we'll build that. Right, and then we'll start the night. I assume these turtles... Is it just like a, like an easy one? Because next round is going to be brutal. Yeah, that was that was an easy round. But then... Oh boy, we're being attacked from every direction tonight. Oh, and it looks like they've got catapults as well. Thankfully, despite the snake curse thing, we have got quite a lot of money. Um, so this bottom corner, we're being attacked just by the flying turtles. I reckon this turret and these scarecrows should be enough to defend. I mean, I may upgrade that turret a little bit, but I reckon that's fine. And then all my troops, I can, I can spread them out up here. I think that'll be the best way to do this. Yeah, let's get these barracks upgraded. That's four more troops. And I got 34 coins. What do I go for? Maybe a turret there could be somewhat useful. And then I reckon let's just upgrade. Let's upgrade these to decent turrets. So what do we want here? Maybe maybe this one can be a ballista one. And six coins. Can I upgrade that? Yeah, I can. Okay, so that will be an upgraded one. All right, and then let's see. Can we take down the Snake King Multiplier? Anyway, we'll start the night. Oh my goodness. The amount of troops that spawned at once. Oh, I didn't realize they all spawned from one direction to start with. Okay, so it seems they only spawned from one place. So I can probably, once we've defended the flying stuff. Yeah, let's grab all you lot and bring you up here. Oh man. Boosh. <laughs> that is a lot of a lot of people attacking. Oh no, we have been attacked from back here. Oh no. Troops. I need half of you back here again. I think we're doing okay, though. I feel like they're definitely being held back. How's the north end looking? But Oh, man, no, the north. The north is not good. The north is not good. Guys, I need some of you up here. Quick, 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 quick. They're getting in, they're getting in, they're getting in. Come on, sword. Come on, sword. Right, I sworded them. I defended. Oh, the catapults. I'm going to have to take down the catapults. All right, I'm behind them. Boosh. Oh, I took one down. Come on, just one more. Yes, have we done it? I think we've done it. Did we defeat the snake god? The snake god? <laughs> oh, no. The calm before the storm. It was a calm before the storm. Oh, that is a lot of treat. Look at those arrows. <laughs> oh, you just dodged them, right? <laughs> oh, that was brave. That was brave. Or was it stupid? No, it's good. Get ready. Sneak up behind him. Boosh. Oh, that is how you do it. Anyway, that is a victory. We defeated the snake god. Ooh, and we got a load more power-ups and stuff. That'll be handy next time. Oh, man, I've unlocked, like, everything. I think because I got to level 20, the game's just throwing stuff at me. Anyway, that was really fun. You can see up here, we've nearly completed this area. You've just got to do the turtle one and then the turtle and a bear. And then we can have a go at mutating some of these other levels. But yeah, for now, I think we'll say peace, love. And tiny little legs. Bye, guys.